Hey YouTube, Eric here. So in the process of trying to find why I don't have enough heat downstairs, what I did discover was about a six foot section of baseboard heater that didn't have any aluminum fins on it. And normally what I knew is if you wanted to put fins on a baseboard heater, you'd have to crack that pipe open, cut it open, slide the fins on, and then solder it all together, and then refill up your boiler system. This is the pain in the butt. So in the process of trying to figure out how to handle this and cre increase the efficiency of my boiler, I stumbled over a product. The product is called a fin clamp element, and it's made by a company named Fabtech Logic. And it comes in a few different pipe diameter sizes. And what I could tell from the internet is it comes in one and two foot lengths. Now this Fabtech product, it's uh, no more complicated than simply fins that clamp onto a pipe. And then uh, they get held on with a couple of bars and, and clamped on down. I went, brilliant. It's fairly expensive, but given the hassle factor of draining and refilling and soldering, this is a real time saver. So the prep work for installing this uh, fin clamp element from Fabtech is just to simply sand the pipe. And I've pretty much already done this. Sand the pipe, take the, the oxidation off. And so that's all you have to do is you just uh, sand down the exterior of the pipe and you wipe the, uh, uh, the debris off and then you're ready to clamp on the fin clamp elements. on the floor like this is hard for somebody who's had a fusion rack. You need to come at the world at right angles. And here we are. Not able to twist. Or I should say unwilling to twist for reason. There we go. Everything started. Now it's easy. 